Hello, welcome to Drupal 8 SEO training series. In this session we are going to look at installing an SEO checklist uh, module that is uh, going to assist us with our SEO process. And it is called SEO checklist. It is called, S it is called SEO checklist. And uh, at the moment uh, Drupal, I think Drupal 8 version is available. And there is also a, uh, a dependency called uh, Checklist API and that is also available in Drupal 8 site. So we will go ahead and install these two. And one more thing uh, is helpful is for our administration is what's called the module filter that's going to assist us uh, with finding the modules uh, quickly. It just basically categorizes uh, modules and it is easy to find. Because this series is a, a intermediate level uh, course, so I, I assume you already know how to uh, download and install the modules. I will go ahead and install these modules on our site very quickly. Copy link and um, extend under extend you go and paste it, add a new module, paste the link over there and install. And add another module, click on uh, checklist API and copy link. I'm going to install that, then number 8, copy link and paste, install and this is the module filter copy link and um, enable let's go and enable the newly added modules administration there is a module filter there is uh, under other there is checklist api and under meta tag there is SEO checklist and install. Checklist, module filter and SEO checklist. Very good. So as soon as we do that we can see the module filter is now working. These more, all the modules are now under different category and you can easily navigate and find uh, the module you are looking for. Now let us configure the SEO checklist. Uh, these are the SEO modules, right? So we are going to configure SEO checklist. Go to configuration and search and metadata and there is SEO checklist. And this is the SEO checklist module look like. What this module does is it, it's just a checklist of things to do. It is not programmatically changing your Drupal setup or anything. It is just uh, uh, like a notepad. It is just uh, giving you different things you need to do for your site SEO, different modules you must have installed and all that. You just check what you install, what not install, what need to be done, things like that. So good idea to read the, the first uh, page. The important thing to remember is this is a, a technical SEO and this is not to do with content uh, SEO. You have to do your uh, content first. You know you need uh, the quality content uh, for optimization. So you need to create that content first with uh, appropriate keywords and all that. Then this is the website SEO that uh, it, it does all the technical part of it. So but you must have your uh, quality content in there in the first place. The things we need to do is all uh, arranged like this um, and you can go through one after another and install them. And next, what this uh, SEO checklist does is this is an extensive list of things we need to do and you can go through one after another and check them off when you when you finish it. Alright so let's go the uh, we read the, the first part so you understand what is it about and uh, the next one we installed and enabled SEO checklist. There we are, it's already done. So it says check off each uh, SEO related task you as you complete it. But, and don't forget to save button. So we already uh, installed that, so we can save it. 
we must save it each time save so SEA checklist progress has been saved so once you did it you go through the next one and uh, some of them are optional so this is optional what is the next one optional install and enable coffee module coffee module help you to navigate through Drupal at women faster I find uh, a coffee module is pretty useful so we can go to the uh, Drupal site and find it and install it so let's look for coffee module in uh, drupal.org so coffee module search for coffee there we go search there we are coffee module help you to navigate through Drupal admin faster that's what we want click on that and it is available and we can install using the normal we can install it paste install so where is the coffee module uh, let's look for that coffee F -F -F -F. there we go click on that and install coffee module has been enabled you can check this item when you finish them right we follow this checklist and tick them off when we finish each item so that's it we will be following this checklist in the rest of the series right thank you for watching hello if you like this tutorial please subscribe to this channel and share it with friends thank you